Betty Jean. This is our Valentine's Day edition. Today we're going to be making a Valentine's Day dinnerware set. Very affordable. Okay, let's get started. So today what we're going to do is we're going to be making a plain dish look like this. A plain cup look like this. And then we'll have a table setting for your Valentine. We will also be making candle holders napkins, of course, to coordinate with the dinner plate. What you're going to do is you're going to shake your paint really well down and you're going to make a heart. After you make the heart, you're going to make little dots. So anybody can do this. Just have fun with it, like I always say. And make little dots. And then, what you're going to do is you're going to make little lines, but be careful because the little cap can get in the way, like it is right now. And you can make swirlies, and it doesn't have to match your other napkin. Now I'm going to change colors. And I'm going to make another heart in a different color. If your paint gets funny, just clean it off with a paper towel. And the pressure of your hand is how the paint will come out. Change your other heart. What you want to do is you want to make little tiny dots again. To match your other one, not exactly. Little swirls. And bring it down and you can do whatever you want you can do all different holidays if you like Christmas you can do Christmas trees Halloween Thanksgiving just every day could be special with your dinnerware and you're gonna change colors and what you're gonna do is you're gonna add another heart and the other color done with your painting what you want to do is you want to add some rhinestones you'll make a nice big dot and it will act like glue pick up a rhinestone it could be any kind of stone that you like from the craft store and take a pencil back of the pencil and push down and that stone will seal in there again I'm gonna put a stone here gonna put a stone here and a stone here so I'm gonna take the stones and drop them in really careful that's where your pencil comes in to pick it up and you're gonna push down with the eraser and you're gonna grab it and do it again where you like and push down and it'll seal it up can do colored stones be creative okay and this is what it would look like dried then I would take a nice mug and I want to do the same kind of look to match so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to take this plain mug and I'm going to add hearts to it now I'm going to make a simple heart, one more time, and you're going to see a beautiful table setting. Fill in your heart, not too thick. Now don't forget, you can't put this in your dishwasher, you're going to have to use your little hand and wash them delicately, but it's worth it. And I'm going to put some little dots going upward. 
and some down here. Make another heart and fill it in. And then add your little dots, dot, dot, and a dot. Now this is really simple to do. It's just the technique of your hand pressure onto the paint. And I'm going to change colors one more time. And if you're not sure if the paint's not coming out right, use your little paper towel. And I'm going to dot a couple of these on here. And I'm going to make a little baby heart here. And we're almost done. These can be purchased anywhere at the dollar store at Plain. And there's your mug. We're going to add some stones to our mug. And I'm going to grab one of these and stick it in the thick paint. Remember? Go upside down on your hand and press down. Use your pencil. And again, make it thick enough that it's going to adhere to the mug or any surface that you're doing. And if you wanted to do this in the summertime, it would be great with seashells, glass found from the beach. Okay, this is our plate setting. Our plate setting has our napkins that we made, our dishes that we made, our candle holders that we made. The one thing I did want to show you is these are plain little roses that you can get at the store and they have come with wire. And what I did was I just wrapped the wire around the napkin. Thank you for watching this Valentine's Day special. And I hope you have a great Valentine's Day. And have lots of love.